Hi guys, my name's Adam Corbett and I'm a motivational speaker. As soon as I introduce myself, people say to me, you're a motivational speaker, how on earth do you get into something like that? Well, I was on The Apprentice back in season eight and those of you that have seen the show will know that every year there's a candidate who gets up and he's gonna do a presentation, he's gonna do really well and then all of a sudden he gets up there to speak to a bunch of people and he completely falls apart. That was me. One minute I'm flying high, next minute, bang, nightmare. Unbelievable. I got complete stage fright. I was overcome with fear and anxiety. I got the sweats, I developed a cough. It was horrible. Failed massively, 180 people in the room, 10 million people at home as well. But do you know what? I dusted myself down. I licked my wounds and I had a look at where I'd gone wrong and, and I started pulling apart the presentation and I quickly picked up on the things I could have done much better. And then I went and asked for some advice, I went and asked for some help and before you know it I was back up speaking again. I was frightened to death the first time I went back to it but I absolutely loved every minute of it. Do you know what? Our failures really aren't so long as we learn from them and they determine who we are. So if anyone out there has done really bad at something, please do use me as an example because you can always, always learn from it and come back much, much stronger. In fact, it's what I do for a living now. And I've spoke in over 500 different schools, colleges and unis to over 100,000 young people. I love what I do. I inspire the next generation and invest a lot of my time into the next generation to help them become the uh, best version of themselves, surround themselves with the four best people that have got their best interests at heart and bring out the best version of them. My story concentrates on my life from 16 until now, on resilience, on hard work, on being the best ver version of yourself, on creating opportunities and happiness, getting the life that you deserve. I concentrate on education, the importance of qualifications. Of course, the more qualifications we can get, the more options we can have. And the more options and choices you've got in your life, the happier you are. My keynote lasts for about 45 minutes. And those of you that have never had a speaker in before, I would highly, highly recommend it. I know some fantastic motivational speakers. Some are very area specific and some are generic for an overall boost wherever you want that maybe it's a boost for year 11 before exams or maybe do you know after all this is over this pandemic this absolute crisis we're in at the moment maybe you want somebody to come in and sort of like rally the troops and get everyone back up for education big challenge at the moment of course learning remotely engaging students i know how tough this is you know if you're not in the same room as them it is very very hard to uh, get the engagement that you want and to get the works completed. What's worked for me massively with my existing clients is working on uh, competitions and basically setting the challenges. So one of the challenges I do is my enterprise challenge, which is come up with a business idea, product or service to help out in this pandemic or after this pandemic is over. So do something, come up with an idea that will benefit the human race as a whole during or after this. Maybe it could be a way of coming up with some new PPE or maybe it might be a way of coming up with something to make everybody remember how the environment has actually benefited from us all not using our cars, from travelling as much and everything else and a way that we can continue that after all this is over. It's a bit like in the morning, it's like The Apprentice, in the afternoon, it's like The Dragon's Den. So it is a competition. There are awards, there are appraisals, there are trophies for the first, second and third team. And there's also individual trophies for the most enthusiastic on the day and the best energy as well. Students really engage in this. It shows them a different way of learning. Really, really broadens their horizons, raises their aspirations. And people excel in these days that people generally don't engage as much in, in class. Um, we find that they really, really engage in this type of exercise. So it really, really is good fun. And as I say at the moment, something which you, I'm still able to deliver online. Guys, please do put together a vlog if you haven't already. I love watching the vlogs that I've seen. I was absolutely honored to ask to do one myself. I hope that my information that I've given you is helpful. 
if you are thinking of booking a speaker uh, and you want to have a chat about it and you need someone specific or you don't know where to start please do give me a shout uh, my social media channels are very very easy to find my name's Adam Corbett, motivational speaker. I would like to say, please do, guys, take care of yourselves and each other. Send in lots and lots of love. This is all getting very real now and affecting people close to us. So, please do stay home, stay, stay safe, and save lives. I'll speak to you all soon. Thank you.